does it. It's very tight squeeze. I'm really hungover, I want to. This is Anzac, I'm here with Dan. Uh, Dan's Melbourne boy. Uh, originally from Melbourne? No, originally from Sydney. From Sydney, that's right. I knew that, I'm just saying. You know. And um, you love your hip hop. Um, you DJ a bit, you know, your hip hop. Uh, and you've got some mad tats. I thought you could pull them out and show. Uh, you love your Aussie hip hop, but we were just saying before, you prefer American hip hop than Aussie hip hop. I guess my question is, um, has that always been the way? It's not, probably not preferring so much as uh, I've always listened to American hip hop. Yeah. And back maybe 20 odd years ago when I first started listening to hip hop and that, it wasn't so much Aussie stuff. stuff out of yeah, yeah. there is now. Yeah. yeah, it's the stuff that's coming out now. We'll listen to it. Yeah. Because I mean, I do like Aussie hip hop. And maybe it wasn't as good as American shit. It's, it's not that it wasn't it's good, it just wasn't yeah, readily available like it is yeah. these days. Yeah. Um, I mean with more labels and everything taking on more artists, so yeah. it's out there more. Uh, yeah. And always because the American stuff's just always been there, I've always had yeah. that access to it. So. Yeah. So out of all the rhyming, break dancing, graffiti, um, scratching, all that shit, what, what's what's the I guess the element that you like the most? Just the music, man. Yeah, just listening to it. it. That's what it comes down to. Seeing it live. It's just, I mean, yeah. the scene's good, everything that, you know, surrounds it. Yeah. It's good, but ideally, yeah, the music. Yeah. yeah so. so show us these tats, mate. We, we all want to see them. So can you hit all elements in your tats? What do you got? A few of them. You got scratching, you got turntables. You hold it up, you got there. That's a scratching. What else you got? Mike, got the MC, Mike. So you got so graffiti, I got spray paint, I think you got spray paint can. That's all just stuff I've got down in Los Angeles, there's yeah. some friends there. Yeah. They're right into the scene over there. But you got more too, so what else you got? There's other stuff there. That's all. So you got graph here. All that stuff graph. was basically done. Yeah. Friends of mine from Scotland, yeah. South Africa and all that. B-Boys, B-Boys. Yeah, they actually came out here. Yeah, and they, sweet. Well, not here where we are now, but yeah. came out to Australia and they basically went out to it, just graphing up around the whole yeah, Australia. Yeah, sweet. And so that's all these. Got anyone breaking on your arm, yeah. break dancing? No, definitely not. Okay. And, tra and look at this, man. Got the trainers. <laughs> it's old school, that was 20 years ago. Okay. What's your first tap, dude? Was your first tap a hip-hop tap? Uh, first up was uh, Family Crest right there. Welsh, yeah, sure. Uh, sure. Yeah, cool, man. That's so it's Dan, he's B-Boy, loves his hip-hop, Melbourne boy. Thanks for being a part of this, man.